Here it is, boys. One of my highly anticipated videos that I've been waiting to put out for you, okay? I have been keeping my eye on this so closely that I'm probably the first person to get one of these things. This is the Zenith Trainer from Flytanium, and boy, am I so excited. So this is the box that comes in. I have not opened this box yet. I'm just filled with excitement. What does it say? Bushing pivots, 7075 aluminum speed channel handles. This thing is literally what I've been looking forward to ever since I've seen this trainer blade, which has been so heavily cloned by every single company. Um, and it was originally made for the Benchmade 51. They finally have created their own trainer with that blade, and I am so psyched for it. Now, I just want to start off by saying that a lot of people are probably going to have the question of, will this blade fit on the Benchmade 51? Probably not. It looks like this one might be a little bit bigger than the uh, other one that they created. So let's go ahead and open this. Oh my gosh, look at this. Amazing presentation. Is there anything on the inside? Amazing presentation. We get a sticker right here. Flytanium. Check it out. Very beautiful. Very amazing. We get some hardware right here. So, comes with some hardware. It does not have bushings, but it does come with the pivots and some washers. And then, there it is, boys. The amazing trainer. With a very nice... Um, forgot what they call this like a latch pocket kind of thing i'm pretty sure there's a better name for it hold on while i undo this it feels like it's going to take both hands to do this yep it's very secure all right here it is let's take a good look at this thing before we start flipping it oh man i'm actually so psyched about this all right here we go let's open this bad boy up sheesh dang now that I'm looking at the blade, yeah, I don't think this would fit the uh, Benchmade 51. Don't take my word for it, though. You might want to ask them, message them. Oh my god, guys. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> Yo, what? Wha Who did they have to kill to get this for 60 bucks? What? <laughs> what bro wait what this flips insane Whew. don't up the price on this please don't up the price on this but i feel like this should be 120 bucks for what i'm flipping right now what oh my gosh guys if you get the chance to even grab one of these please do while you get the chance I highly recommend this just based on the first flips alone and I'm not partnered or sponsored to say that I bought this with my own money I've just been paying close attention to this because I really love the design of this. I think they did a fantastic job the Stone wash finish the crowned inlay the chamfer. I'm sorry the chamfer inlay with the crown uh, spine on both sides Oh, man, this is so nice. Let's go ahead and take a look at that speed channel open and close Here's the sound. Very bouncy and nice. Very chimey and ringy. Oh my lord, guys. I'm blown away. Great job, Flytanium. Literally great job. You guys are an insane. Wow. This is one of the best trainers I've ever flipped for its price. Like, literally, this thing is insane. It's ridiculous. I don't know how they were able to get these materials for this cost. Um, <laughs> Double-sided torques. It looks like T8, though. Um, so, I guess there's maybe a cut there. I don't know. In terms of price. I mean, I don't know if those are copper. Looks like bronze phosphorus washers, but it could be copper. I don't know. I know they had to make a cut somewhere. Maybe on these Zen pins? I mean, I thought that from one of the looks, I thought that the Zen pins might have been tunable, but they're not. They're actually just press fit, which is very nice to see. 
But yeah, guys, I, I sort of sound a little bit speechless, but at the same time, just repetitive on what I'm saying. Uh, I'm just blown away by this because I was actually pretty shocked at how well this is balanced and is flipping right out of the box. Let's go ahead and check tap now that we've been flipping. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, boys. This thing is on bushings, no tap, great sound, 7075. I don't know what the blade seal is. Maybe they could have compromised there, but I have no idea. This is just absolutely remarkable. I can't get over it. Let me let me let you guys hear the sound for a second while I stop talking. If you guys want to pick this up, flytanium.com. Uh, go grab yourself one if you can. I don't know if the, how long these will be available or how much they have or if they plan on continuing this. Is this a one-time thing? I have no idea. But whoever they had to kill to get this for that price is maybe worth it. <laughs> I know that they actually didn't, but who knows? I mean, this, is, this price is remarkable for this material. Um, but yeah, if you guys are interested in getting something that looks great, sounds great, feels great, and just is great for its price, then the Zenith Trainer by Flytani by Flytani, I'm sorry, I'm tripping up on myself now because I'm just in love with this thing, is a very amazing trainer to get. This thing is just, I, I know this video is going to sound like I'm just like, you know, going crazy over this thing, but it really is that way. I was... I was actually very tired today. Um, my sleep's been all types of messed up, but this came in the mail and I was like, oh yeah, it's, it's video time. So this is literally me on like barely any sleep awake for like a long time. And then this is the energy I still have when I get something this great. So this thing is just very nice. I will be updating you guys in the future on any wear or tear that this thing develops. But as far as right now, the sound is great. I still got no tap. Speed Channel 7075 Zenith Trainer by Flytanium. Absolutely remarkable. Pick yours up today if you can before they're gone because this is actually pretty wild. Anyway, I will be seeing you guys in the next one to come and peace. Yeet.